You know, pets are such an important part of our family. You know that, don't you, Bailey? And if you have a pet that is having an issue of some kind, you want to get help for the pet because, yes, you agree, because how you relate to that pet is so important in incorporating the pet into the family. We are so happy to have Chuck Stella back. You're from Elite K911. You are obedience and behavior with dogs. And we have here your dog, Bailey, right? This is Bailey. And what kind of dog is Bailey? Bailey is a boxer mastiff mix. Okay, beautiful. Look at the color. I'm yeah. telling you, look at the color. Look at the coloring on this dog. It's beautiful. It's a very good paint job. So now, is Bailey's a rescue, right? Yes, Bailey's a rescue. Okay, can you explain a little bit about the things that Bailey's been through? Yeah, Bailey, I got a call a, a couple years ago from Love Astray. They wanted me to go out and evaluate a dog they had adopted out a, a year prior to that. They said the dog was very friendly, but they were getting a call that the dog was being aggressive. So they adopted it out friendly and were getting calls all of a sudden. Okay. So I went out to see the dog. Um, the dog was jumping up on a six-foot fence trying to bite people that were walking down the street on the other side of the fence. I don't believe that. Yeah, Look it's hard it. to believe with her. But she was very, very aggressive, very territorial. And uh, so the people, they didn't want to keep her anymore. Um, so they asked us to take her back. Okay. So Love Astray asked me if I would work with her. And, of course, I worked with her for about three or four days and decided that I really loved her, um, which is typical okay. in rescue. You get attached oh, and you start sure. adopting dogs. Oh. Um, but I ended up keeping her. Um, we turned her around in about a month. A month? Her. Yeah, she, got, she turned around very quickly. Um, she just needed guidance. She was a very, um, very misguided dog. She didn't know she was protecting the territory, which Mastiffs do. They're very protective. Sure. So she was just doing what she was allowed to do. So we changed that behavior. Uh, we taught her to be social. Uh, we have a cue for her. If she ever gets nervous, we, we give a command okay. and say hello. Okay. So if she ever gets in a situation where she's not sure, we give her the command and she's fine. Right. So she does very well with that now. So is there a definition of what a rescue is? I mean, yeah, there really is. Uh, I mean, and it's, it's, it's a pretty wide definition, but um, any dog that's rescued from a situation where they're either self-destructive or, or, or abused by someone, uh -huh. um, I, I consider a rescue. I consider her a rescue because she was very self-destructive. She was get, doing things that caused her to, to possibly be euthanized. Okay. Oh, yeah. So, uh. so she would be a rescue, um, you know. People go to the pet store and they see a puppy mill dog and they want to call that a rescue. Um, yeah, Rosie was yeah, that case. And it's, yeah, and it really does, it, it, it furthers the puppy mill industry. Yeah, so it's, it's kind of a hard rescue because you really want to save the I dog. Know, right. But in that case, you're also promoting it. But, right. you know, the dogs we rescue are, are dogs from the streets, dogs from the pound, high kill shelters, okay. things like that. So somebody at home who's watching this and has a dog that's, that's difficult mm -hmm. and they call you, what, do you go to their home? Do, you, do they bring the dog to you? Depends on the situation. Some dogs I want to see in my training center. Okay. Um, if they're highly aggressive, um, or very territorial, um, I will determine where I should see them. A lot of times it's at their home because I want to see that actual behavior. Um, a lot of it is just behavior, um, just naughty dogs, dogs that are just rambunctious, young, whatever. A lot mm -hmm. of times we'll have them come to our facility and do the evaluation there. Okay. But if it's truly aggressive, I want to see it in its own territory I um, so I can determine what needs to be done. And my guess is you have a plan of how many times you would come out. You'd assess it first and figure yes. out how many, yeah. Yeah, we, the evaluation is where we determine what we think it's going to take for the dog to, um, to be turned around. So. She's feeling comfortable. She's Look getting, at this. She's, she's stretching lazy. out. Yeah. That's great. So if you have a dog at home and you're having difficulty, you might want to give Chuck a call to be able to come and assess the situation. And you can get a hold of Chuck by calling him at 440-666-0749 or go to your website at EliteK911.com. Thank you so Thank much you. for being here and for bringing Bailey. She's Thank you. Beautiful. Stay tuned. We have the Romance Review, review coming up. Next, the government has a pension for taking some of your pension. Our financial expert relates how to protect yourself. Then, how can you be in style if you're out of touch with trends? Coach Kathy counsels a frustrated fashionista.